Hi, Yarnabees. Hi, Yarnabees. <laughs> nice up the nose shot. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it is 6.30 in the a.m. on Saturday, September 17th. It says 16th on your dash. Oh, okay, well. Whatever. But let's not get ahead of ourselves. Yeah. <laughs> George and I are on our way <laughs> to um, my daughter's house, Tia's house, because gender reveal! Yay! Um, yeah, so today is the gender reveal, and we are, well, <laughs> I'm excited. I don't know about everybody else. It's been a kind of a cluster, and um, everybody's stressed out to the max, and whatnot and so I I'm excited about it but I'm nervous about it because I'm barbecuing for like 70 people <laughs> so yeah why are you shaking so much because you're hitting bumps in the road good lord anyway um yeah so <laughs> yeah James uh Tia's other half kind of went a little overboard and started um inviting random people out of the phone book yeah so they're <laughs> She's expecting about 70 people to show up Are to this. Are you going to show them you? <laughs> Hello. Um, she's expecting about 70 people to show up, and she's feeling very overwhelmed and very stressed out about yeah. having to feed such a large group and all of that kind of stuff. And, and then he actually went out, and he's on a job today, a tow truck hauling job. Well, he should be back by Up now. in the interior, and he's supposedly supposed to be back by now, but he kind of did that at the last minute and kind of left it up to Tia to kind of yeah. do all the organizing and whatever, so she's just, you know, luckily she's not pregnant and hormonal or anything, so <laughs> she's just kind of spinning out of control, Yeah. and then Sandy's here spinning out of control because we're on the island and we can't just run right over and help yeah. him out, so the plan for today for us is just to go over and, and help in any way we can, we'll either... Uh, man the barbecue um, we've decided um, because it's not like a baby shower um, where you normally people bring gifts and stuff but we are gonna put it on yourself, you know. that we're gonna um, uh, do a raffle so I went and uh, Sandy went and bought a hundred dollar uh, gift card to the government liquor store something we can all use and we're gonna and sell we're going to need to and then use. yeah and then we're gonna we'll probably use it ourselves <laughs> um, and then we're going to uh, instead of asking for people to donate money which I feel a little funny about um, we're just gonna say hey just uh, we're raising money for them for baby stuff so we're selling raffle tickets bucket ticket ch chance to win uh, chance to win a uh, hundred dollar gift card so yeah thought that would be a little more reasonable than people would be a little more free with their cash hopefully in the hopes that they're gonna win something and then We'll raise a bit of money for James and T to buy one of those million dollar baby strollers that they sell or <laughs> whatever else. They're more expensive than my van. Yeah. Uh, but they, anyway, yep, yeah, they're, they're starting from scratch. They got nothing, so they're going to need everything. So, yeah. and it's been way too long since we had babies. To, we don't have any old stuff lying around, so. But George keeps trying. Yeah, I, I keep trying, but Sandy <laughs> just won't get pregnant. I don't know what the hell's going on. But. Uh, anyway. Uh, anyway, okay guys, so I'm going to try and video uh, as much as I can of this and um, hopefully you enjoy it. And including the big moment? Yeah. Um, did, you, did you describe to them how they're going to do this? No, it's going to be a surprise. Oh, so I know um, a lot of people know that sometimes they do like the pop the balloon reveal or other weird stuff. These guys have a bit of a unique one. Uh, that Sandy wants to uh, be a surprise. I won't tell you what it is. Hopefully, it's not going to be like that one that we had a few months ago where they actually started a forest fire. <laughs> they fired off a bunch of fireworks for a gender reveal and started a huge forest fire. That anyway, let's not let's yeah, not let's do not talk let's about not do that. that. Uh, we don't want any fire <laughs> and explosions. Yeah. Um, so anyway, it's going to be a long day. I'm sure uh, we're already up earlier than we like to be. Well. Sandy is. Yeah. Um, I got up at 4.30 this morning because that's just Again? what I... Again? Well, I couldn't remember if I would set the alarm for 5 oh, for or 6, sakes. so um, I woke up. It was 4.30. I had to go to the bathroom. I thought, well, I might as well just stay up, so 
that's what I did. And I let my little flower here sleep in till almost six o'clock and woke her up and said, come on, let's go. And I went, no, don't she, make she, me do it. And she cried a little, but she's here, so. <laughs> I got my coffee. It's all good. Yeah. Well, now we're going. Um, so we got a reservation to get on the ferry because lately the ferry situation here is uh, a real horror show with... Uh, a lot of people coming, they're, they're short staff like everybody else in the world, so there's been uh, cancellations and sailing weights and um, you know, we love being on an island, but the only bad part of it is when you gotta get off of it and get back on it again. Yeah. Uh, normally we never wanna go over to the other side where all the crazy people live, but that's where Kia is, so that's where we're going, so yep. um, anyway, is that okay, it? Okay, that's it. Okay guys, we'll keep you updated as we go. Um, and uh, we'll talk to you soon. Bye. Bye. Okay, this is Sandy in her happy place. This is the Marine Division of Crochet A Canada, as you can see. On land, sea, or air, she can crochet underwear. <laughs> or whatever. You know what, you guys? I just realized something. This is the first time since before COVID that we have been on a ferry or been anywhere. Hmm. It feels weird. You know, it's like we're on the ferry and it's almost like we forgot what to do. <laughs> so, but it's nice. Very peaceful, no drama. So, yeah, it's nice to get out again. Hi, Yarnabees. Hi, Yarnabees. Oh, okay. So, <laughs> we, <laughs> what a we day. We are here finally, and what a cluster. Oh my God, everything's all disorganized, but that's okay. Um, we're getting it done. And then we realized Highway Through Hell is here. So they're actually doing some filming, yeah. <laughs> which I guess will be on an upcoming episode of the show. Yeah. Uh, whenever the new season starts. So they were interviewing Tia, interviewing James. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, we get here and nobody knows where anything is. So yeah. we've uh, shown them what we've done. So we've basically set everything up. We've brought in all the, the food. We've got it all set up. We've got the table set up. We're going to be able to start barbecuing. Uh, yeah. Whenever we get the thumbs up, nobody seems to really know how things are going to go. The, yeah. the filming crew may be here, but the director isn't here, so nobody knows. Like, oh, if we're doing the reveal and then we're eating after, we're going to eat first through the reveal. So, yeah. we're all just kind of hanging out, looking at yeah. each other like a bunch of grade eights at a high school dance because nobody <laughs> knows anybody. Oh, but that's okay. But, uh, we will figure it out. So, we will let you guys know what's happening. And, uh, yeah. Stay tuned. Bye. So, you can tell that a lot of these guys are racers and stuff because there's a lot of nice cars here. But, uh, yeah, we've got the car getting set up with cameras inside and getting the packs ready to go and it's getting exciting. So, yeah, it's soon. It's soon. We've got, we've got pink and blue balloons all over the place and getting ready to go and like I said there's really nice cars sitting here <laughs> so yeah uh, 
So apparently, if you cook the food, they will come. <laughs> Grandma's on the grill. <laughs> <laughs> Grandma's burning the food. <laughs> okay, guys, it's time. <sighs> oh, that's kind of neat. Are you, are you filming the drone? We're getting ready for the big moment here. Woohoo! We've got TV film crew. Yeah, we got the film filming crew. This. We've got. We've got the bear in the air. Yeah. The air. Tia's over the there. Air. James is wandering around. <laughs> So, James is acting for the camera. <laughs> they <laughs> they already did that. <laughs> yeah, that ship has sailed. <laughs> and this is the guy who is going to be in the driver's seat. They have little canisters for all the kids. Whoops, trying to zoom me out, guys. They have little canisters where they're going to shoot them off. technical difficulties and they have to switch cars. I know. So the rider goes and picks The problem up. was they were using a Chevrolet <laughs> and, and, and it wasn't working. So now they have to use a Ford because they oh. gotta get the job done. Yeah. Ford still sucks. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah they have to switch cars now. Stay tuned. Okay let's try this again. Now do we have to do some practice runs again or just Oh, nervous. It's a boy, it's a boy! <laughs> <laughs>